To build a custom route to follow with your Year 10 Lazine GPS cycling computer, log in to www.lazine.com slash GPS route. If you don't have an account, one can be quickly and easily set up. Or log in with your Lazine Ally V2 app profile details. Once logged in, look for the device features pull-down menu at the top and select routes. To begin building a new route, find the area where you want to start by repositioning the map with your mouse. Then scroll in as close up as possible using the scroll wheel to get the most accurate positioning. Left click on exactly where you would like to start and select set start. You can hold and drag the marker with your mouse to fine tune its position. Now, zoom back out and reposition the map to the area of your ending destination. Then, zoom back in as close up as possible and left-click your exact ending point and select Set End. Now find the Calculate Route button and click it. It will then calculate three route options to choose from. It will also default to the Bicycle Travel Mode. For walking or driving travel modes, select them in the Route Review window. Once you've selected your preferred route, find the new route name text box and name your route. Then click the Save Route button. Your custom route will now be saved and can be accessed by clicking Saved Routes. It will now also be available in your Lazine Ally V2 app in the Navigation tab. Tap the pull-down menu and then tap Saved Routes. Here you can select one of your saved routes. Make sure your Year 10 Lazign GPS computer is paired with your app and that you have a GPS signal. Then hit Go. Once it is loaded to your GPS device, the app will ask if you would like to get directions to the start of the custom route you built. Once you reach the start of your route, your GPS will automatically start the turn-by-turn -turn directions. To edit a saved route, go back to the Saved Routes page and select a route from your list. Then click the edit icon toward the left of the route building header. The red nodes you see can be dragged to alter a route and they will then turn into a waypoint. You can also manually add waypoints along the route to change your course. Zoom in to where you want your route to go and left click on the exact spot you want to travel, then select waypoint. We recommend to not exceed five waypoints. Use the help box to delete a waypoint. Once you have edited your route, click the Calculate Route button and again select from the three route options. Then click the Update button next to the Route Name text box. Your edited route has now been saved. You can also add frequently used locations to the My Places page. These are for quick access when building a new route, such as home or work and can be accessed by clicking Save to Place when building a new route. Click Address on the My Places page and type in the address of a frequently used destination and give it a name. You can also save locations directly in the Ally V2 app. In the Navigation tab, tap the pull-down menu, then tap Save Current Location, give it a name, and then hit OK to add it to your saved destinations. Or, after creating a route in the app, Tap the pull-down menu and tap Save Destination. Give it a name and click OK. This destination will now be added to your saved places. To get instant navigation from your current location using the Lazign Ally V2 app, make sure you are paired with a Year 10 Lazign GPS computer and have a GPS signal. Next, tap the Navigation tab. In the Destination field, type in an address search for a destination, or select a saved place. After selecting a destination, tap and confirm that you would like to get directions. Or you can simply find a location within the interactive map and tap where you would like to go and then confirm you want to get the directions. After loading, you will have three bike-friendly routes to choose from. You can tap on your preferred route within the map or tap Next Route Option then tap Go. The app will then send directions to your GPS device and it will automatically pop up once the route is loaded. You can now follow the turn-by-turn -turn directions or follow the breadcrumb trail on the next screen.
If you accidentally go off course while following the turn-by-turn -turn directions, a warning will pop up to let you know you're off route and to turn around. If you decide to continue and you are still paired with your phone and within cell service, you will be automatically rerouted. If you're out of cell service range, you can simply follow the breadcrumb map to find your way back onto the course and the turn-by-turn -turn directions will still function. You can also turn off auto rerouting by accessing the main menu of your GPS computer. Hold down the menu button for two seconds. Use the menu or lap button to scroll through the menu. When you see navigation, click enter. Then click enter again to turn auto reroute on or off. You can also cancel navigation in this menu. If you turn off auto rerouting, you can force your computer to reroute by holding down the enter button if you go off route during turn-by-turn -turn navigation. Lasign, engineered design.